Hello everyone, welcome back. This is the Empress. Happy to have you guys here with me today. I hope you all are doing well. I'm doing great. Um, my energy level is through the roof right now. I'm on 10 right now. So I want to share and spread that energy towards you guys. And I'm going to do a spread today on what um, what's next. You know, what course of action are, are they going to take towards you? So this is currently on a person that you are thinking of. So take the moment and kind of think of, you know, you know, your person, um, because we're going to be going into how they, um, are going to, what action they're going to take towards you coming in, coming up. Okay. So we're going to start off with Capricorn. We're going to go through Capricorn all the way to Sagittarius. Okay. So what course of action are they going to take towards my collective? My subscribers, what course of action are they going to take towards my subscribers? You guys need to stick around to the end. We're going to pull some love oracle cards, okay? All right, let's let's do it. Capricorns. Someone here is they are worried possibly that you aren't being honest okay they may be worried about whether or not if you're sneaking around if you are being unfaithful um so i just see them being stuck in their head okay stuck in their thoughts currently aquarius i see some type of coming together reuniting um with you okay so, so they're they're wanting to return to you and come together with you pisces i see um they're going to be taking some type of action towards you with this king of wands energy there could be lots of passion here lots of fire desire type energy um, they are going to be pursuing you. Um, someone here is looking at you as very single and independent, um, and focused on your career and your finances. So I feel like someone here is going to be taking action towards you. Okay. Someone is going to be like this. Someone is looking at you as like, you know, very like you, like you are on top of your game right now. Okay. All right, Aries. Aries, I feel like someone is stuck um, in their thoughts about you, okay? They aren't sure how to go about this. They're not sure what action to take. Um, but they are going to, they're thinking about a logical way to, to deal with you, but possibly to communicate with you. Taurus. Someone here is definitely, they're waiting on some type of communication from you, okay? They're waiting for some type of romantic message, some type of flirty message, or waiting for some type of romantic gesture from you, okay? Gemini's, I feel like they are wanting to put their guard down. But it is up um, because they feel that they are in conflict with you, like they're in trouble with you. Um, there's, there could be a trust issue here, but their guards are most definitely up towards you because they feel like they're in some type of trouble, like in the doghouse or some type of trouble. So their guard is most definitely up, okay? Cancer. I see that they want to make some type of forward movement towards you, okay? They they are most definitely they're wanting to come and there's some progression that they want to make with you. They want to see things move forward with you. Leo. Someone is uh, 
wanting to communicate with you, but they feel like it's a risk if they reach out to you. I do feel like they want to communicate with you, but they feel as if it'll be it's just risky. Okay, so you could be expecting communication coming in for somebody. I feel like they want to take a risk, but at this, you know, they may be afraid to take that leap. Okay, Virgo, someone is most definitely thinking about you and they want to communicate with you. Libra. Someone most definitely wants to communicate with you. There's like a small, like they, it's like small talk. But someone is like making a final decision to reach out to you. Scorpio. Someone is hoping, <laughs> someone still has hope for the situation and they're also watching you. They're keeping an eye on you. Or they're hoping that you're keeping an eye on them. Someone most definitely here is spying, okay? They're hoping that you reach out to them or hoping that you can, you know, come come towards them or or come communicate about to them about what you saw or heard, okay? Sagittarius. Ooh. Something here <laughs> something here is most definitely the, like hidden. Okay, they want to keep some, it's like they want to keep you in the dark about something. Okay, they want to keep you in the dark. Something is hidden. Sagittarius. Sagittarius, you may get an unexpected message from this person, okay? Out of the blue, this person just reach, reaches out and, you know, communicates with you. All right, so let's take a look and see what the Love Oracle cards have. What messages do we have for the collective? I'm picking up immediately that a lot of people are waiting to hear back from someone, waiting for someone to communi communicate with them. Okay, so for a lot of you guys, you know we are currently in the Mercury retrograde phase. Okay, so a lot of people are returning back from the past. You know, skeletons in the closet, coming back around. Ooh. Someone wants for, <laughs> someone is looking for um, an apology or forgiveness or wanting to heal the situation, okay? This person feels that you are their true love, okay? That you guys are possibly just having a disconnect, you know, a disconnect moment, okay? Someone could be worried that you have someone new, um, but they really want to give this relationship a chance with you. So someone wants forgiveness here. Someone wants to heal this situation. So for a lot of you guys, this could be someone from the past. That is um, knocking at your door, okay? Yeah, we got healing family issues. So for a lot of you guys, a lot of people's focus is on healing um, this their relationship, okay? Because like I said, I feel like someone here feels very disconnected, like you two aren't um, really on the same page. There could be some deception going on. And some someone feels like, you know, your friends are helping you be deceptive. Um, and they're feeling like, you know, this isn't fair, it's unrequited, you know, it's, it's just not fair, okay? There's lots of healing energy going on currently. People are wanting to heal things, okay? And then once again, they feel as if you are their true love, okay? So this is why they are wanting to heal 
the situation. I feel like, like I said, for some of you guys, new love is on the horizon for some of you guys, okay? Some of you guys have new lovers, and you don't want to heal this situation from the past, okay? Some of you guys have moved on from this past lover, and you have new love coming in, okay? And that's for some of you, but the ones that exes are coming back around or your exes are, you know, back in the picture, they are wanting forgiveness and they're wanting to heal the situation. They have finally come to the realization that you are their true love, okay? You're the romance of a lifetime, all right? You know what? I want to grab a few clarifiers, actually. Okay, I feel like this person has been holding back, but they want to um, want to apologize, want to communicate with you um, and give this situation some type of clarity. I feel like this person has been holding back. Why is the four of pentacles here? Yeah, they've been holding back, okay? They've been taking their time, okay? And they feel like you haven't been giving them any attention, okay? They feel like you haven't been giving, showing them any type of attention. And they're wondering why, okay? So they decide to hold back. Um, but all the while, they want um, you to forgive them. And, you know, some of them have learned their lesson. Why is healing family issues here? And I'm also picking up on, like, there's someone is isn't giving someone any attention. So, it's like keeping them guessing, keeping them wondering if this relationship can be healed, okay? Why is healing family issues here? Nine of Wands. Ooh, somebody is so guarded. It's like a warning sign. Watch out. King of Wands, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, energy. Um, someone has trust issues that they need to fix or heal. Okay, why is the Seven of Wands here? Page of Cups. Someone is talking a big game. But someone here it isn't trusting it, okay? Yeah, someone here it does not trust. There's there's a trust factor here, and someone here is like, I don't want to regret letting my guard down, okay? Someone here is like, you know, I'm not ready to communicate just yet. I'm still healing. It's what I'm picking up. Why is true love here? Someone is going to be trying to put some effort in. Okay. Someone's like looking back over the past. Why is the Eight of Pentacles here? Six of Cups again. Okay, someone is trying to reconnect or rekindle because they feel like you are the romance of the lifetime. Okay, why is the Six of Cups here? Someone is, I'm getting try again. Someone is <laughs> someone is looking for some some passion, some fun, some spice. So they're going to try it again. Okay, someone is feeling like this is a romance of a lifetime. Someone wants to try something again. Someone is looking for their soulmate. Yep, 
two of cups knight of pentacles capricorn's energy but someone here is looking for their their soulmate okay and they feel that you could possibly be their soulmate and they want to try this again for a lot of you this is people someone returning from the past okay someone that's still holding on to this someone who has not let go and this is just for a few because some for some i did notice that there is new love coming in for some okay some of you guys are like no i don't want my ex back i do not want anything to do with them you have new love coming in okay but the ones that are wanting an ex to come back around or are willing to accept someone from the past to come back around i feel like there is an opportunity for that currently okay all right my loves i hope these messages were helpful all right if you like these messages guys make sure to leave a thumbs up let me know what's going on in the comment section and share with your family and friends as well okay don't forget to click the bell to subscribe until next time ciao for now